Hold on, I gotta do a proper like YouTube intro. Hold on, I got this ready. Watch this. <clears throat> what the fuck is going? <laughs> no. No. So yeah, <clears throat> recently discovered a super secret MLG OP42069 no. feature slash strat that has been RL craft apparently this whole time for three, three, four years, however long. And nobody, to my knowledge, nobody has ever found this or known about this. Cause I've never seen anybody ever bring it up, talk about it, post about it on the RLCraft Reddit, nothing. But this has been something that has been in RLCraft since it initially blew up. Here's the funny thing about this OP strat, Mick Bobberson. I can show this off because it doesn't actually work anymore. <laughs> since 2.9 came out. No, we, uh, we broke it in 2.9 by accident. So to show this off, we have to go back to 282. So let me quickly boot up 282. There we go. Ah, good old 282. Nice. Haven't seen this menu screen in a while. Take a wild guess. I'll let people guess what they think it is. I'm gonna create a new world. It's not the boomerang. It's not the boomerang. It's not the piston arrow thing. So I knew it battle towers. Nope. Nope. This is really obscure. Infinite infernal spawn. Nope. It's not that. It is not that. Are you guys ready to have your minds fucking blown? Let's go to let's go to a good area for this, right? Could it be abused to hell? Oh, if it still worked in 2.9, it absolutely could be. Especially since we added a lot of new potions and i'll just kind of leave it at that for a moment can i get like a good biome here that's not trash all right here we go are you guys ready we added the inspirations mod to 2.9 which allowed us to change around all the cauldron behavior stuff right and then you can now make potions in cauldrons and have like a fire underneath the boil and have like uh purified water that's what inspirations does inspirations is what's breaking what I'm about to show you in 2.9 because Inspirations completely overrides Cauldrons. In 2.8.2 and below though, I don't think anybody thought Cauldrons had a use, but apparently there's another mod that is in RL Craft, and I don't think anybody ever experimented with this before. So I'm gonna take, let's say some poison potions. Yeah, put them in the Cauldron, nice. I'm now going to take a vanilla sword. And I'm going to right click on the cauldron. I have now dipped my sword into the cauldron of poison. And as you can see, we have poison two on our sword with 64 hits remaining. And it works. It only lasts for two seconds, but it works. Now, wait a minute. Hold on. This gets a little crazier because it's not just, it's not just that. Hold on. Wait a second. Wait a hot, fat minute here. Let's take a potion of decay, like Wither, which is a custom potion. This Wither potion, potion of decay, this comes from better survival. This is not a vanilla potion. And then let's take a custom sword. I don't know, something like the saber. That's right. This not only works <laughs> with custom potions, but it works with custom weapons too. So now I have nice. a stone saber with wither two on it. Now there we go, look. And it works. It's a short effect. So it only lasts for two seconds, but you can see it working. There's the particles. It works. It's epic. This is a thing that has been in RLCraft forever and nobody knew. And we broke it by accident in 2.9 because we didn't know this fucking existed. So apparently this is actually the better survival mod. Yes, the one that adds the other shields and like the starting weapons, the throwable spears, hammers. Better survival has had this this whole time. And I... <laughs> There's so much shit in RL Craft, even the owner doesn't know. So yeah, 
Now, you can remember that we added a lot of new potions from Potion Core into 2.9. So there's some interesting potions from Potion Core that this could now apply to, right? Nice. Imagine if this worked in 2.9. Okay, let's see. I don't know. We have things like the Thundering Potion, nice. which could... Oh, and actually, if you try to mix potions together, it blows up. <laughs> So here's the thundering potion. Let's take our sword, dip it into thundering. All right, now we have lightning on our sword. Hmm, let's see. Yup. This is fine. <laughs> I don't know if it only goes off once or like, yeah, I, okay. I kind of figured that was gonna happen. There's a lot that could go wrong with this. One of the things that can go wrong uh, and doesn't really work correctly is Remember the explosion potion? Explosion of detonation, which when, you know, you drink this, you blow up. Case in point, obvious, right? Yes, okay. However, if you try to put explosion on a weapon, because this is not something that's supposed to last a certain amount of time. It's supposed to be an instant hit sort of thing. Um, but the mod that allows effects to be added to the to weapons doesn't realize that. So we end up getting a little bit of an infinite loop. Oh no. And I'll just show you what happens when I hit a cow with a sword that has been dipped in an explosion potion. <laughs> Give it a second. Give it a second. Hold on, we're lagging. Just halt, wait, and there we go. Okay. <laughs> Oh, man. Um, so, yeah, it's kind of a good thing that this doesn't work in 2.9 right now because, oh God, this would be horribly broken. But yes, you can, in fact, in 2A2 and versions below 2A2, you can dip any weapon into any potion and it just works. All of this just works. Flawlessly. Nobody knew. Nobody new but uh yeah i thought this was uh kind of interesting to show off and i do plan because we were working with the better survival guy and he mentioned this and he was like have you tried this and i was like no way and he's like yeah way and i'm like no way and he's like yeah way and then i tried it in 2a2 and i was like oh my god this is a thing so he's actually updating better survival right now to write a compatibility plugin to work with Inspirations, which is the mod that is conflicting and breaking this in the first place. So this will be a thing that works in 2.9.2 when that comes out, hopefully. And we may have to like either fix the issue with the explosion potion or like have a blacklist to not let explosion potions work. Um, I haven't found any other ones that are really bad, but um, there's some really, really funny ones. There's like the potion of levitation. This is a fun way to just smack mobs and then just have them float away, which is always, <laughs> always good. Yeah. <laughs> and this lasts for seven seconds. So this is, I think this is gonna make cauldrons more useful in our craft now, and maybe we'll see like some new epic strategies and shit. I don't know. I'm kind of excited. We'll have to see. We will have to see.